I also want to report that the advisory subgroup on education met last week to review COVID measures in schools and early learning and childcare settings. I can confirm that in light of its recommendations, revised guidance is being published today, which effectively returns schools and early year settings to the situation before the emergence of Omicron. Uh, the revised guidance eases requirements for bubbles or groupings within schools, and it is less restrictive in its advice on visitors to schools uh, and on school trips. Uh, the subgroup also considered the issue of face coverings last week. It concluded that although we may be close to the time when face coverings no longer need to be worn in classrooms, assuming of course that current trends continue, we have not yet reached that stage. Uh, no one wants young people to have to wear face coverings in the classroom for a moment longer than necessary. But given the current uncertainty about infection trends in the immediate future and the relatively high levels of COVID in younger age groups, continued caution is prudent at this stage. The subgroup will consider the issue of face coverings again at its meeting on the 8th of February.